Susan Marie here. Thanks again for joining me. We are going to stretch it out. Okay, so there's different types of stretching that you should be incorporating into your training. Static stretching where you just hold it at the end of your range of motion and you, you hold for 30 seconds. Dynamic stretching, which is kind of holistic, uh, high kicks, under control of course. And we're going to do what's called PNF stretching, proprioceptive neuromuscular facilitation. Uh, that big word, which uh, basically, it's a technique which stimulates neural proprioceptors. It's complicated, so we're gonna simplify it. It's basically an isometric contraction against maximum resistance. So they used to use this exclusively back in the day just for rehab, but you can, it's a great technique to help improve flexibil flexibility uh, and help you push through plateaus and yeah, get more flexible, which is what we want. Okay, so you're going to extend the leg. Okay, this is, we're gonna target the hamstring here and you're going to um, pull in, okay? So now the technique is you're going to exert force against your hand, so you're going to push against your hand, so you, if you've got instability in your knees, you're going to want to hold closer to the joint, okay, so you're going to push at about, let's say, 50% intensity, okay, and you're going to take a big breath before you do it, and push and hold. Exhale, and you're just going to want to pull in that leg a little bit more. Uh, what happens is it kind of fakes out your, your muscle fibers, your cells, and there's a release, okay? So when you push with the force against your hand, okay, you take a big breath and you almost kind of hold in your breath, okay, for about mm, 8 to 10 seconds and then you release it and you let that stretch fall a little further. Okay, second set. So you're gonna push with 80% intensity at the end of your range of motion. Ready, take a big, deep breath and push. Keep pushing, keep pushing. Push, push, push. And relax. All right, so you'll notice that the leg starts to come, fall for deeper into the stretch, the flexibility is increasing, you must, must be thoroughly warmed up for this, okay, it's, uh, warmed up means you've broken a sweat, you have circulation in your body. Okay, so, final set, you're going to push with maximum resistance against your hand, so as hard as possible, okay, and you're going to hold it for, uh, again, 6 to 10 seconds, 8 seconds. All right, ready? Take breath and push. Push hard, hard, hard. As with great intensity, maximum force. Three, two, one, and relax. And now you're just going to, yeah, relax into that stretch. It's naturally, it lengthens those muscle fibers. And that is a technique you definitely want to add to your stretching uh, to increase your range of motion. And just enjoy the stretch. Extend that leg up if that feels good. And repeat it on the other side, of course. Symmetry is very important. Okay, so we're just going to figure four. Okay, I'm going to pull through, okay, and we're going to do this technique um, in this position, okay, so flex your foot, okay, you're going to pull in, now against my hand, I'm going to push and resist, this foot is, this leg's going to resist, this leg's going to try to push forward, okay, a lot going on, okay, maximum Con isometric contraction against um, isometric contraction against maximum force. Okay, let's go 60% to start. Ready? 
Take a breath and push. Push, push. You're trying to push against that leg. Okay. And release. And breathe. Okay. As you breathe, exhale and you try to relax into the stretch. Set number two, 80% intensity. Take a deep breath and push, push. Push, resist. Okay, your resistance against your own body. And relax. All right, you should be able to pull it in a little bit closer. This is a stretch for the glute medius piriformis. It is a very tight muscle in many people. Okay, set number three maximum exertion, okay? Maximum contraction. Ready? And take a breath. And push. Push. Push, push, push. Resist. Come on, make it count. And relax. You should be able to pull that. That's a lot closer than before. Okay. So. Relax into the stretch, hold it there, and look through the ankle. And now I'm going to drop this leg. And I'm going to try to cradle my foot. And you, because I'm in the maximum stretch. And here you just want to make sure that your abs, the back is safe, contracting your abs. And enjoy it. All right, you got to do that same thing on the other side. Get stronger, get more flexible, and stay balanced. All right, have a good, big faster day.